Welcome everybody to another episode of Latif's Inspired. I'm in Bangladesh. I'm staying at a resort called Dasai. And I've just had a lovely entertainment and now I'm hungry. I've got a buffet, a lovely little buffet over here. I think it's continental food. There's a bit of Chinese and Indian. They've even got naan breads. Right, I'm staying two nights at this amazing resort. It cost me 45,000 Bangladeshi taka, which worked out to be 371 pounds for the two nights, which includes the results and all the activities that they give and uh, breakfast, which I'll show you. So make sure you like, share and subscribe and watch till the end. So I've just come from Silet. It's taken me a good one hour, one hour, and I've arrived. A lovely place. I stayed here last year, and I thought, you know what? I'm going to give these guys uh, a nice little vlog for you guys to visit. So if you're visiting Bangladesh, and if you're from Silet, this place isn't too far. Just in Malay Bazaar, so it's about just one hour away from Silet. Fantastic little place. It's raining. However, when you come in here, there's lovely little fans. Oops. There you go. Fans, air-conditioned place and a lovely environment which I'm going to show you. So just checking in and I'm going to be shown to my room. Lovely scenery. Some fantastic little resort. We're just getting shown to our room. Yep. We've got a nice little buggy. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Bala, sir. Thank you. Ah, thank you. So we're just getting taken to a little tour, going to be shown around this lovely little resort. Nice little water feature. Oh, no. Is in the resort. Car park. Car park. Okay. Tennis courts, badminton. Best thing I like about this resort is it's secluded away, so it's very nice and very peaceful. Family villas. Nice little lake, complimentary for all the public who are staying here. Beautiful, very beautiful place. Ah, okay. Complimentary swimming pool. 8 o'clock to 9 o'clock. Okay. We've got to open the spa for the females. So this is the room we're going to be staying in. Oh. Oh, very nice room. A nice little room here. Fantastic. So this is complimentary. Some fruits, bananas, orange and apple. Nice bed. Got a complimentary water, tea and coffee and Pringles and nuts and that's chargeable. Also over here comes with umbrellas, slippers for the house, prayer mats. Nicely thought out. And stain. Yeah, for this bathroom, oh, nice walk-in shower, very nice and clean. Nice bed, telly. Let's open these French doors. Oh, oh yeah, nice little tub, beautiful.
peace and quiet. I'm gonna have a little rest now. So this is the Dizhai Resort, Sri Mangal, Mali Bazaar, telephone line, etc. Some rules and regulations. Right, so I had a little bit of rest. And now I'm gonna check out the resort. Right, I had a nice little rest. And now, just giving this a lovely resort a little tour. Best thing I like about here, I've been here before, it's nice and peaceful, very peaceful. So it's about six in the evening, very warm and humid. Let's go on and go and check out the local entertainment. Lovely little accommodation. Family rooms, nice little pond. Lovely little spa. There's family using the buggy. You can call them for room service. Come pick you up. Nice little seating area. If you're chilling with the other half. More seating area. Peacefully secluded away. This is the banana leaf restaurant. We'll go on. We're definitely going to have breakfast here. Families. Badminton and tennis courts for the locals. Peaceful, very family friendly. And if you like private sort of lifestyle, here is the place to come. Desai Resort, Mali Bazaar, Sri Mongol. Fantastic place. Back to the reception room. Grapefruit trees, loads of fruit trees around here. I'm sure there's going to be some jackfruit trees this time of the year. Lovely waterfalls. Some films that they are showing. You can watch some films in the cinema if you wish. The lobby area. Cafe. So this is the restaurant in the resort, the banana, banana leaf restaurant. So it's the menu, some soups, appetizers, sides, mains. They also do desserts. So let's check out the restaurant. So to start off with, some soups, looks nice. Hot sour soup and desserts, amazing salads. It's like just cut up vegetables, cucumbers, carrots, lovely little coleslaw. This looks nice. 
for some pasta salads. Some lentil curry. Oh, vegetable aubergine. This looks lovely. Lentil dal. This is aubergine. Continental food, this is beef. I look saying Beijing beef. That looks yummy. Jamaican jerk chicken. Looks wonderful. This looks like also more chicken. Tandoori chicken. Sweet and sour fish. Grilled fish and barbecue sauce. Pasta. This looks nice, vegetable rice. And naan bread. Wonderful. BBQ chicken wings. And these are potato croquettes. Looks lovely. this out come on so we've got some lovely tandoori chicken some fish these are chicken wings lovely little salads and potato croquettes I'm gonna enjoy this first thing I'm gonna try the fish looks lovely bismillah delicious some salads. Crispy, crunchy. Lovely. Let's try this tandoori chicken. I'm going to see I'm going to enjoy this meal. I'm going to tuck in and enjoy everything. So I had some lovely starters. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to Get a bit of salad first. Like a nice little coleslaw. Get a bit of coleslaw. Mm. I like some olives. So this salad got a bit of olives, peppers, tomato. Looks like bit, bits of uh, Parmesan cheese, which is delicious. Chana dal. Being in Bangladesh, you have to try the lentils. So I'm going to try the lentil. Lovely. Roasted vegetables. Let's try some roasted vegetables. So it's got cauliflowers, aubergine, sweet corns. Looks yummy, and even mushrooms. There you go. Look at that. Mushrooms, aubergine, cauliflower. Looks yummy. I'm going to try some beef, so Beijing beef. Doesn't look as appetizing, but I'm going to. Lots of shredded beef. Looks wonderful. So, good decent amount. Jamaican jerk chicken. I'm gonna try some Jamaican jerk chicken. I hope it's spicy because the starter wasn't as spicy. So let me try. This looks nice and juicy. So grab one. And then two pieces. There we go. Tandoori chicken, which I've tried already. 
sweet and sour fish. Haven't tried fish, so actually I'll try the sweet and sour fish later. Too much food on the plate. Pasta, grilled fish, vegetable fried rice. I'm gonna try some vegetable fried rice. Put a bang in the middle, that was lovely and colorful. Looks yummy. I'm gonna get a naan bread as well. Kulla, kulla, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. You want a naan? Huh? You want a naan bread? Some lovely naan breads. It looks nice, fresh, and fluffy. So, this is my plate that I'm going to try. Looks wonderful and delicious. Right, I've had some lovely starters. Now I'm going for the mains. So, I've chosen some chana dal. This is called Beijing beef. Um, shredded beef. This is the Jamaican jerk chicken. I'm quite surprised as they do this in Bangladesh. So I'm, I'm eager to taste it. The naans looks wonderful. Got some lovely vegetables, some aubergines, some mushrooms, um, some lovely rice with vegetables. Um, it's very nice colourful as well. And I have some salad. I've got some coleslaw and some other peppers and tomatoes. Now let's give it a try. Right. I want to try the beef. <clears throat> Smells nice. Doesn't look as appetizing. There you go. So I'm hoping it's lovely, fresh, juicy. I don't know how, what how spicy it is though. Bismillah. Not as juicy, it's quite chewy, but there is freshness to it, that's the good side of it. It's not been sitting there for a long time, just shredded it up and cooked it. Let's try this of the chickpea and the rice, I mean, sorry the chana dal with the rice. You can't go wrong with the dal. Vegetables. I love some good decent vegetables. Nice. Jamaican jerk chicken. I'm hoping it's spicy. Should have been a bit more spicy, slightly sweet. But I'm gonna enjoy this. Actually let me try the naan bread. Ironically, I'm going to try the naan bread with the Chinese beef. I thought since it's a buffet, I'm going to try everything. So I've tried um, some starters, I've had some of the mains, and now this is a soup. I know I should have started this earlier, it's called an egg drop soup. So I'm going to try a bit of that. I bought myself a roll because I missed butter in Bangladesh. There's not much butter, so this is proper butter. Um, <clears throat> can't find myself a knife, so what I'm gonna do. Yummy. Oops. Lots of butter. It's almost like it's Cheese. Simple bread and butter I've, miss, I've been missing. Lovely. Let's try this egg drop soup. Mm, it's quite nice actually. I like that. a chicken broth, some vegetables and they just dropped an egg in it, hence egg drop soup, 
and you stick it in here. Look at that. Mm. Butter in that hot soup. It's the simple things that are the delicious. We go in again. This is lovely. So simple. Bread and butter and soup. Can't go wrong. I've enjoyed that soup. Get a do side water. Sweet and sour fish. Let's give this a go. I don't like the quality of fish that they've been using. It just looks like it's a little bit overcooked, a little bit rubbery. Fat tilapia. So, the good thing about the side, it's a lot of food selection. However, I like traditional food, and this is not traditional food. It's continental food. Nothing here is spicy, I'm actually missing spice. And the best thing is the rice. The vegetable rice is amazing. Mm. Let me enjoy. Get one of these. Chocolate souffle. Got fresh fruit salads, strawberry forest cake, and an apple crumble. Let's go for one of these apple crumbles. So apple crumble. I'm missing some custard. I wish there was some custard. These are strawberry forest cakes. There we go. Chocolate souffle and a mixed berry mousse. Let's give this a try. So, finishing my meal, very busy in Dusai. I had loads of starters, loads of mains, and I finished off with some lovely desserts. So all in all, fantastic choices at this side. And now, finished, gonna rest and chill and see what happens tomorrow. Right, day two. Had a lovely sleep and woke up late. Had a quick shower and went back to sleep after Fajr. Now, we're gonna have breakfast. I'm gonna show you this uh, breakfast buffet. Uh, in Dusai. Check it out. Some good breakfast going on. Toast, bread and butter, croissants, muffins, pastries, fruits, bananas, cereal. That's nice. And French toast. This is some pasta for breakfast. Sausages. Looks like vegetables. Some chicken. Asian breakfast. Kuchiri. Parata. Toast your bread. 
Fruit juices, orange juice, papaya juice, tea and coffee. And they even do fresh eggs. So fresh fried eggs, also scrambled eggs. It's quite nice to get fresh eggs since it's a buffet. So I cracked up on some eggs. Beautiful. Get a seasoning. Yes, please. So fresh cracked pepper, seasoned with a bit of salt. So an omelette as well. Thank you. Thank you so much. Very good service. Right, I've tried a bit of everything. I'm gonna go and try the traditional breakfast a bit later. So I'm starting with my toast. So butter, I've got a bit of jam, I've got a bit of marmalade, croissant, parata, and a fried egg, which I'm gonna try. I don't wanna to have too much carbs. So I'm doing one side with jam and one side with marmalade. Butter's still hard. <laughs> this would do. I'll just make a sani out of it. Yep. Bismillah. Good choices, I'll show you some more. It is nice. Now I've chosen a selection of uh, breakfast after having the toast. This is Buna Kishori, a traditional Bengali breakfast. Now it's a cross between pilau, it's a rice dish, it smells nice. Rice and lentil mix. They've got some veg uh, chicken as well. Looks like chickpea and potato. It's gone a bit cold. Taste is okay. We've got sausage here. Sausage and a bit of tomato sort of sauce. Some seasoned vegetables. Carrots, it looks like white cabbage, green chilies, potato. I had a lovely breakfast experience in Desai. Uh, a very good selection. Toast, lots of butter, uh, marmalade, jam. They've even got porridge. Uh, tea and coffee as usual. Uh, nice selection. There's got a bit of Bangladeshi uh, breakfast as well. I wanted more Bangladeshi style breakfast. Um, they've even had pasta. So various different choices. I think the diners are enjoying it. So, um, basic standard sort of breakfast but all in all um, good choice and um, nice 
uh, oh, and, and they made the fresh eggs and uh, omelettes, which was a good option, which I went for. So a uh, nice breakfast in Dusai. 